Okay. Hello. It is I. It's been a while. Don't judge me. Anyways. <laughs> we are... Like I said before, we are back. And we have a new game today. It is called Moonlighter, as you can see. Now, all I've seen for this game was the trailer. From what it looks like, it's pretty good. So I thought that... And I have not played this game before. Like... What... Oh, you guys have... Oh, other videos that you have seen. I've played this game before. Like, uh, for example... I had, a uh, Doom before, but now I'm getting, like, uh, this stuff. Anyways. Since I haven't played this game before, I thought that it would be nice to share an experience with you. Uh, one night, Nazas... They called them the Dungeons. Strange, ever-changing ruins of unknown lands. Soon enough. Blinked. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> God damn it. It's loading currently. <sighs> um. <gasps> oh, thank God. I don't have to be silent anymore. Okay. 
makes a lot more sense. Oh, yeah. Okay, so he's also gonna open. Okay, so that's sort of uh, fabric. I'll take that, I guess. I don't know if that's something that's ancient. Uh, but I'll take it anyways. I was probably just gonna leave it. Keep that as is. Um, sound. There we are. Line. Just turn you to. Hey, you're fine. I don't know what you mean. We'll keep this as a I've I've made a mistake. <laughs> oh boy. Oh wait, didn't they say that no one's made it past the fifth floor? That was the fifth floor. Okay, so I think I get what they mean. Okay. What a sorry looking kid. All alone now. Rest for a bit, Will. Will I have you know what? What? <laughs> so confused. What did he say? What did he mean to say? when he said, take this, it's dangerous to go alone. I think that's what they meant, too. Yeah. Now that I get up, you're wasting my time. I like to shop all day. Let's see if I can get through your heart and some of the tricks that I picked up from your grandfather so many, many years ago. I, I just had to get in character. You know the dot, dot, dot. Two things. It's knowing. Value is with 
just a band coming out of the shop of Huh. Oh, yeah. There's someone here. Jesus, okay. What'd you say? Sweet. Good chance. Did you see that? Best expression you can hope for. Side was too expensive for that. Then, and not so cheap. You know, these problems. You should pay attention to your customer's expressions. Charge higher when something is high. Demand is in high demand and in low supply. I am shitty at reading. Take out your merchant notebook. It should hold all the information. You have gathered and discovered wares and artifacts. Let's see, where are you? Huh. Tired. Can't tell. Since the sun has fallen for the Two seconds. I just head off. You'll pick up more on your own. Restoring this shot to its full glory. Responsibly falls to you. Not to it is, it's in your blood, Will. It's oh, is my name Will? God. In the meantime, why don't you try out that new sword of yours? There is one more pair less at night, but one can always find better artifacts. I wonder if I can change the price on that right now. I don't go on now, these mere bones of my mistress. Was that his Okay, dungeons are this way apparently. You know what actually I think we should just go back and see if there's anything else for me. Maybe like a little Item that can help me out. I don't like that considering it's nighttime. Raymond. I'll send my son. Where I find you? Oh, we'll have. S have you seen Masa around? Not a chance. No problem. I don't have a chance. Yes. Rainaco. Rainaco. Whatever the f you call it. <laughs> May not be as prosperous as it used to be. And he still has a difficult sword for the gold dungeon. Possibly even one closed if you were lucky. Hmm. What are you? Right. Have you found any new cultural artifacts in these dungeons? In the dungeons, Will? Yeah. I've always found it fascinating. The items are found in the dungeons. They appear to be from entirely different civilizations between the cultures. It's a point. Good. Stay that way, peasant. Not like this. The freaking box is like the bears cutting down trees. Okay. He's still in the cut. He's out of the bush. Yeah, I kind of thought that was gonna be the case. Can I cut you down? I cannot. I'm just going around seeing if there's anything that I can cut. I can't. I can't cut the air, apparently. Yeah. Sir always wanted to become a merchant. He never felt dependent. Must have been used today. Found when the dungeons were first discovered. Since then, finding a new one all has become nearly impossible. Guess I'm lucky. Where are you there? Need the dungeons. <sighs> there are boxes right there, but I know I got soldiers into the dungeons now. Yeah. What is 
is this thing? Why am I so slow? Oh, dungeon. Dungeon available to merchants and heroes. <clears throat> what are you? Desert dungeon. Only for heroes. Okay. Tech dungeon. No entry. Uh, you. Oh, that must be like uh, outside. Ooh, what are you? I'm gonna guess you're. Volcano dungeon? <laughs> that is not what Quick Forest dungeon available to heroes now recommended for merchants. That is, that is not a forest. That is not a forest. But I guess I went to the Golden Dungeon. I'm just never going to get over that. that forest dungeon. That is not a forest. So now we play this game without any restraints. So from what I'm able to gather, that old man's friend is dead, and that was him. I, I don't feel bad, but I don't feel good. Big boss gonna kill me. I supposed, I supposed to let them all out. Now I have to chase this weird creature that stole my stuffs. Uh, big boss gonna get so upset with little me. like this. <laughs> so you could just go in there, take some stuff, come back, maybe put it up for sale, get some cash, go back in, get better stuff, sell better stuff for better 
item or for better gold get that gold buy stuff upgrade your items all that and then eventually you're gonna have to beat the bosses and that's a long game that sounds pretty fun to me while the young proprietor of Moonlighter has returned you look intact finally learn to use that pendant properly it's about time boy what are you holding is that a chart of the dungeons where did you get this you you found all of me. Oh no. Dead. Ooh, see, this is what happens when you chase that what's behind that door. Leave it, Will. Just get the artifacts you need from the Golem Dungeon. And look after Moonlighter. Now, I know some posts on the town board that may interest you. Some shops want to move in. Attempt to revitalize this town. Apparently, they need some startup capital first. Would be nice to see some new life in Rhinoch. Nice indeed. <sighs> this game, it's, uh, it's the girl one, man. I'm starting to like it. A lot, actually. Can I come in here? So iron rods instead. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, I'm done. I forgot how the system worked for a second there. Seems like a fair price for ten bars. See a whetstone. Take all that I can. Is it there? Probably for forty. I don't know how much it's worth. There we go. Okay, so this seems pretty fun. Let's see. Oh. So useful. Oh god, you have no idea how useful that is. <laughs> Seriously, don't. I have to press A for every item that I want. God, that's irritating. <sighs> Glad that I could just press R and B and it just all goes away. Investments. Town shop. See what's in town. for 500. Do you feel the dungeons are too hard? Tired of your old weapon? I can solve it if you give me enough money and materials. A forge to be reckoned with. For a wooden hat. Is the blue force getting you nowhere in the dungeons? Visit the wooden hat to find potions. Potions and enchantments for this and that. I'm probably. It's between the Wooden Hat and the Vulcan's Forge. Because if I get the Vulcan's Forge, then I can get better stuff. And for starter equipment, it should be pretty easy. Maybe just a couple iron bars and fabric. Maybe some roots and whetstone. And that I can take out of the chest. But if I do a potion shop, then I can get better stuff. More gold to sell. I think I'll probably go for that. I think I'll just go back to the dungeons for now. See what I can get. Maybe get some, uh, not maybe definitely get some better stuff. What are you over here? Ooh. Can I talk? No? Can I light myself on fire? Damn. This game's not good. Fucking <laughs> controller just got the crap out of me by shaking. <laughs> Not see that coming. Not gonna lie. Oh, another thing. 
that I want to bring up in this uh, video. Um, I have been thinking about, I don't know if you guys have heard about this game, or, or not, that's fine if you have or haven't, but I've been thinking about bringing Dragon Ball Fighters to the show, to the channel. Now, <laughs> I can't say I'm good, because I'm not, but I can help the party you. Oh hell, get away from me. So whatever items that I don't have on me just gets lost forever. This is not better. This is not better. This is far from anything. At least I'm all better. This stuff doesn't damage me. Good lit. Dang, good job for me. Ow. Kill it, kill it. Oh, there. Uh... I just figured out how to keep that. Sure. Get 
day marks my first steps into this mysterious domain. I discovered that flowers were growing there. A small and incredibly charming village just north of the crater. And they are quite a unique occurrence. Any number of adventurers may enter a dungeon. Adventurers may enter a dungeon at once, but no one will ever venture to get there. These dungeons seem to build themselves around one entry. For each person, in the same labyrinth twice. One must exit the other. If no one is currently inside the dungeon, does it make any sense? Now these, these are the questions. Many right now are flooding to these dungeons for their treasures, completely disregarding the inherent, the inherent danger that will stop creatures inside, but just for some gold, some fame. No, it's all about the questions for me. Where did these dungeons come from? Why do they constantly shift and change? And why are they filled with unseen treasures? I'm not here for the what. I'm here for the how and the why. <laughs> that one's kind of cool, but... I think I did pretty well. I, I, I do not like that screen. <laughs> that that was not this adventure. That was just my own damn arrogance. So apparently to use the pendant, I need to have more than 100 gold. If I have 101 gold, I can travel back instantly. If I have 100, nope. <laughs> It's still nighttime, damn it, dude. How is it still nighttime? Oh, wait, I'm supposed to fall asleep, aren't I? <laughs> oh my god, I'm so dumb, dude. I'm so stupid. I thought I had to go into the touch. Until the night passed. Nope. God damn it. I mean, that's one way of doing things, but nope. Nope. Shop. Let's see. Oh. Maybe I could raise the price a little bit more next time. See, now I have enough to travel back. Interesting little game. <laughs> Build fuckers back? How? Are you back? Oh, that's right, I gotta change that. Uh, if I'm being honest, I have enough items to, uh... Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I'm... Let's 
167. Let's see. Let's see what I can get from back here. Those iron bars seem to be profitable enough. What are you? You son? Yeah, you might be good. You, you will sell for a profit. That I know. Interesting. Okay. Um, I'm just dusting the waters right now. Yeah, nah, nah. You crazy if you think I'm not gonna raise that price high. Making that profit. Get all that sweet, sweet cash. First of all, I want to see if um, that's a good enough price. Seriously, 150? Yo, shit. We're just down to 130. 120, how about that? Actually, go up. Yeah, I'll put you on three two. I know how much you guys go for. Same what you go for one thirty. <sighs> My profits today were almost five hundred. Damn, that's a good ass profit. Ask me. <sighs> Ocean shot. Damn. Yes. Come on. Hey, 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 hey. Who, who are you? You knocked the one I ordered. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> Thank God. Let's see what can I get from you. <laughs> My apologies. It's just this book. It's... So good. Yes, I am yours. We were the potion master. Come to the wooden hat. Do you need a potion or a chin? We want to craft today. Potions, 100%. What can I do for. <laughs> 15,000, by the way. 15,000. 15,000.
guys are going to see if, or not see if, but I want to um, get enough profit so that I can just go back whenever I feel like I have enough. And I can do that if I have 98 gold. so far. What are our profits? 630 vol. This water feels. This... Okay. I was like, I need 200 from snow crystallized energy. Jesus. Okay, that's good. But, five water spears goes for 135. That's a good price, apparently. So if I can get it too low, I can get two Maybe. I mean, that's probably the highest dollar. I don't think I want one of those. I, in fact, I know I don't. So I think I'm just gonna have little loot while I'm at it. Just in case. Hey, you must be Will, you know? The one who requested my forge? My name is Andre, Andre Forge Master Extraordinaire, I believe. It's weapons or armor you seek. Falcon's Forge is the place. 
after you. It's bandana. Here you go. on there. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. okay. So the max of that guy is 300 is what I'm saying. 500. Wait, what's this? 400? Not bad, not bad. It now and now that I know that in there it will literally stand still so why are you doing Seeds or something? Not working the time. Probably worth my time. I didn't notice my health. <laughs> I just died, bro. Come on. It's my other damn fault for not paying attention. Definitely taking you. Whatever I know. Chests holding our most basic tools keep vanishing. Um. <sighs> so, this is what it's like to be touched by the gods. Oh. I hate this. I hate this. Stay. 
It takes 200. Dude, it takes everything from me. <sighs> well, I mean, shit better pay off. If the warrior lady comes in again, it'll probably sell. Yeah, I could probably put together all of those. Um, or something. Hello. I may not be as proper as I used to be. It's still visible. It's a dungeon. Even one of the close dungeons, if we are lucky. I say you're actually a nice person. Quill? What can I do for you? First of all, can you make me a sword? How do I make a sword? Okay, so I found this. With what I have, I can easily make up those profits. <sighs> yeah, let's see. It's not for that I can just hold it on. 81's too good of a price. So putting it up at 200. I mean, this shit's a golem core. There's no way that it's not gonna go for a while. Wait a second. Oh, I'm stupid. Give me a less price. I got a lot of good stuff in that. I'm you know, 100%. <laughs> that seems fair to me. Yep. Let's see. No, no, don't want to put those back in. Can I make it? No, no I can't. Never mind. Okay, 
right, so maybe just one more trip to the dungeon. Hopefully, I get lost. Maybe then. Uh, get some good stuff. Seriously? Is he 200? It's still a good price. time just selling like four items <laughs> well technically four items but more of like I sell I sold ten items I made just as much if I did ah oh, jeez okay so let's see so I can sell the empowering crystals for much more I'll maybe give it 120 next time Golden cores, I think I'll keep that where they are right now. Same thing goes with energy crystals. You know, water spheres, I think I'll bump up to 250. We'll see if that's good enough. You know, I, I got nothing. <laughs> see, so to get a sword in the first place. I need four more vines and four more. I don't know if that's worth it. Might be. No, it's not worth it actually. I was aware that I had to go through that portal to get to the next level. Maybe I'll be on the next level because I defeated the boss. I could be it. That'd be nice. Like 
the stuff it gives me. So many strange devices that, that creature is drunk. Okay, this one's rich and actually it was quite completely rich. For every item you place into this device, hold of some food. To see if the value drops out. It's great if you need to use your pen and pinch. This looks like a mirror, so I'm just gonna call it the mirror. Keeping it simple, not too late. Why do the treasures drop inside? Go. Are they getting the best deal here? Probably. It's a magic item. Hmm. Okay, so all those sticks and vines that I pick up are gonna be to use. What? What are you? Nothing. Garbage. Let's see, what if I put you in here? What should we get me? That's good. Be surprised. Oh, sh- Oh, putting me right into the mix. I cannot hit him. I, need, I think I need a bow and arrow or something. Wait, could you just die? <laughs> I think you just died. Moving rock today. <laughs> Can you imagine a rock that moves? I did what any sensible person would do in this situation. Smacked it right back. Shattered upon the ground, leaving behind a stone heart. A core, as we have come to call it. It's one of the many unique treasures that can only be found in this dungeon. Hmm. Dropped by a guard unique to only this dungeon. I have to say, each of these dungeons have a very peculiar environment, a culture all its own. I'm getting really into this game now. I'm starting to see more of it. Let's see. Oh, you're just. nothing. It's fine. Jake! Yeah, that's what I was expecting. Oh, another 
Golem Warrior. Corrupted. Ooh. Do you have an attack that goes through my shield? in gold right there right there in my hand I, I, I don't even know what the random is. I didn't think that was what was gonna, what was gonna happen Last time, 
But if I encounter a boss, I'm leaving 100%. Because what I had there was way too good. Sorry, but we're closed now, so... Enchantment cores, what the? <laughs> Getting all this stuff that I never knew I had. <sighs> I'm gonna try not to head back to town, but that's one more round it couldn't hurt. Just 
sheer brute force. exhaustion or pain, it, spit, it spits you out, <laughs> eventually. It's a messy ordeal, no one really knows what happens, but one eventually wakes up outside the dungeon, with only small traces of slime nearby, and, well, any injuries they have accumulated inside, yet may accumulate inside, yes, some have left the dungeons to never return, but plenty have stuck it out. Many enjoy the thrill of the fight, many looking Day. There really is so much more to these dungeons, though. I'm probably just gonna buy it out. As much as I want to go back, I'm just gonna go From the two of the dungeons. Fits. Spears. Spears. Spears.
stay in a good place. Decent profits too. <laughs> 1400. Decent! Come on, man.
some is in the right. should not have stepped into. That's what's over here. Actually decent findings. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm never going into those forest dimensions ever again. That nah, was not worth it. Oh, my bad. Volcano dimension. We're touching fuck. Yeah, that was the thing that I had in my inventory. What are you? Ooh. Oh, you are very fun. You're gonna be fun to play with.
Actually, it's from one of the last time. <sighs> I'd be surprised if it's worth anything. That's worth something, seriously. He's going to be the kind of guy that if I don't get something up, he's going to pick it up. Like, 
like, uh, for example, if I defeat the boss, and then, and then all the loot just comes flying around. He's gonna be the one to come in and be like, no, mine. Just snatch it up, probably bring it to me or something. I'm not gonna guess that there's anything that's gonna, like, help me in this game, but I hope this is. Thirty-two. The potions, come on. Don't tell me. I, like, personally put them into this line. I do, do I? Keep on rolling around. The second boss might be able to beat it. Too confident, though.
Um, you guys, uh, weren't there to see it, but, um, well, yeah, yeah, I know, you and, ah, just, oh, fuck me. Can't see it, but my, uh, one of my friends just said, you suck, garbage, die, and, uh, that happened. Fucking damn it, dude, I needed those seeds. Anyways, I, I, th I think that's where I'll leave it off for today. <laughs> uh, I'll definitely stream this again. This is fun. This is fun.